I'm here to talk to you today a little bit about not only these beautiful white seats that I have here in our Model Y, but also if you have black seats, there's a lot to talk about today regarding how you maintain and clean them. You see, a lot of people steer away from the white seats because they're afraid they're gonna stain and they won't be able to keep them looking nice. Well, I just did the 50,000 mile update on this car and I asked you to be the judge of how well these seats have held up. In my opinion, they've held up really well. I'm sitting at close to 60,000 miles now and these seats still look great. For those of you who have steered away from the white and stuck with the black seats, just know this, there are some things that will stain those seats. Sunscreen in particular is a big issue with those black seats and I knew this was a problem and I got to find out firsthand with our Model X. When I had family over, we were swimming out in the sun and using sunscreen was a bit of a problem because it got all over the seats and I was able to get most of it out with just baby wipes, but there were some white spots there that I could not get out. And I'm gonna show you the difference between each of the cleaning methods because I have traditionally used two specific products. And since then I have actually changed because there's a new product. I thought it was a gimmick. I talked about it on one of my recent videos. It's actually a Tesla product. And I do have a link in the description, but we'll get into that in a moment. This thing is amazing. And I'm gonna show you how big of a difference it makes and how this is the right stuff to get to maintain your seats, whether you have black or white. Now for daily use in the car, baby wipes are all you're really gonna need. Unscented baby wipes will take care of almost everything that's going to get on these seats. As long as you stay on top of it, this will do the job. Even transfer from jeans will work with just baby wipes if you're doing it right towards the time that you start to notice it. You gotta do it pretty quick, but this will take care of everything else without much of an issue. The other thing that's nice about baby wipes is they are not very aggressive. They're not going to damage the material on the seats. These are just vinyl seats, but this is a really good thing to start with. Now, stepping up from there is another product. Actually, I've used this 3D orange stuff for many, many years. And this stuff is kind of like always been my secret sauce, so to speak, that's been able to clean a lot of stuff on the inside of cars. Well before I was driving Teslas, I've always kind of used this stuff. It's really good and it is a citrus based cleaner and it does a good job. However, what you'll find in today's video is it doesn't do quite as good a job as I thought it did. And then a step up from there are these Armor All wipes. Now you need to be very careful with these. These would be like a last resort essentially until this new product that I found. These can be very aggressive, but they're very good. But even these could not get out some of the stains in the seats with especially the sunscreen. So these are actually really good. They do get stuff out really well. There's a very strong scent with these. So you need to do this in a well ventilated area, but these do work pretty well as well. They're kind of nice to have in the glove box also but of course, always start with the baby wipes. Now this stuff right here is the magic. I recently found this and I found it on Amazon. They don't even sell this directly at Tesla. I don't know why, I don't know where else you can get it other than Amazon, but this is actually made by Tesla and I didn't realize that at first. At first I thought somebody was just ripping off the logo there with the letters, but this is actually a Tesla product made specifically for these vegan seats. This stuff is amazing. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how each of these stack up. And with the black seats, I have a really good way of showing you how well this works versus the other stuff I've traditionally used until just this year. If you're going to use either of these spray on products, make sure you have one of these. It's a nylon brush that's made specifically for seats so that you don't tear them up. But this does a really good job of agitating the soap and the cleaning detergents and the degreasers into the material without damaging your seats. These are very cheap as well. So having one of these is a good idea. Now, of course, with all of our Teslas, I have used this since day one. This is again, not sponsored, but I've just had really good luck with this stuff. It's actually like a ceramic sealant that you put on the seat and I reapply it every year. Usually once a year, I do a really deep clean on the seats and then I'll apply a fresh layer of this, but it only goes on one layer. You leave it for 20 minutes and then everything that evaporates is gone. And what's left is a film from this stuff right here. It's 
kind of pricey, but you get two to two and a half applications out of it. So it's really not that bad. It's about 50 or 60 bucks on Amazon, but you get a couple of applications out of that. I've just had really good luck with this. It's just another level of protection to help with the cleaning process, especially if you live in a climate where you're gonna be wearing jeans a lot probably a good idea to add another layer especially with these white seats just to make it easier to get those transfer stains off so that's kind of the rundown i want to take you over now to the model x and show you how each of these compare to each other so as you can see right here i have a little bit of a stain and this is actually from the sunscreen and of course as you can see baby wipes are not going to do anything it's not really going to take this off uh, this has been here for a couple of weeks now that's really not what i need to work with so next let's go over to the orange degreaser so the orange degreaser does somewhat of a decent job but it's not really picking everything up and it's because the way that the sun screen latches onto this vegan leather it just does not let go and a degreaser like this stuff will not get it out so the next thing that you would want to do is grab the armor all wipes those wipes are going to work really well usually in getting this type of stuff out but in this particular situation it doesn't actually get it all out it is probably a little bit better than the orange degreaser, but I would not recommend using this often because it is a very aggressive product. So that leaves us with this super seat cleaner from Tesla and check this out. You're going to be blown away. I'm not applying any different pressure with this product versus anything else that I've been using. It just works really, really well. And after two applications, it came right out. So this stuff works really well. Not only am I impressed with how this thing worked on the black seats of our Model X, but I wanna take you over to our Model Y because we had some stains there as well, specifically an area that many of you probably noticed some stains also, and that is actually between the seats. It's not a vegan leather in between, it's actually some sort of a fabric, and this can collect a lot of dirt and grease and grime and all kinds of nasty stuff. I'm gonna show you how amazing this stuff is because it took all of that out even on this fabric side of the seat. So there's a number of areas on this back seat that need to be addressed and you can see them all here. I'm gonna tackle all of them with this and we will use our nylon brush to rub that in and wipe it off with a clean microfiber towel. all the stains out your seats are nice and clean go ahead and apply a fresh layer of that ceramic coat this is pretty easy to do it takes all but five or ten minutes to do an entire car this is not hard work especially if you've already just cleaned this is way easier than that so apply this stuff on and you'll be ready to go for the next one year 20,000 miles 15 12,000 miles however many miles you do in a year once a year, this is a really good way to keep up with the interior of the car. And especially if you have white interior and you want it to continue to look nice, this is the way to go. So at the end of the day, there's three products that I would recommend having. Baby wipes, which you can get at your local store, this Tesla Super Seat Cleaner, and a nylon brush to go with it. And of course, the Leather Shield ceramic coating for the seats. I've been using it for three years and it works pretty well for me. So with those three products, here's what you have to work with. You have baby wipes for the day-to-day -day stuff, keeping up with the low maintenance items. 
for the heavy stuff or the once a quarter, once a year, anything that's really needing to be pulled out of the seats, you have this heavy duty cleaner from Tesla. And then to maintain the seats in between cleanings and to help protect them, you have that ceramic coat. So all three of those things together create a pretty easy way to keep these seats looking fresh, looking new from day one until 100,000 miles, hopefully. That's pretty much it for the chemicals. And if you wanna see an update on this Model Y 50,000 miles later, be sure to click this video right up here. I really appreciate you joining today and I can't wait to see you on the next one.